Today I'm going to be showing you how to make an easy pineapple charm. It is a loomless one. It is only made with a hook. So yeah, this is how it looks like. So let's get started. So for this charm you will be needing two yellow shades and two green shades. If you want, you could just make them the same, but I'm going to have two sh shades, sorry, two shades of both. And then you will be needing the most important thing, a hook, because it's made with a hook. So yeah, this is what you'll be needing, and let's get started. So first, you're going to need your hook, and you're going to take a rubber band, and you're going to loop it three times like this and then what you're going to do is you're going to take one of the two shades one of the two shades like one of each shades yellow ones and you're going to loop it through the band so like that so it should look like this and now you're going to do the same thing take the two and you're going to loop it through like this again and then you're going to do that again so this you're going to do that three times basically so now your loop i mean your charm should look like this so far this is totally not a pineapple so it's not done yet so what you're going to do is you're going to take your cat band and you're going to put it on the hook so it should look like this now and now we're going to take the two shades again push that in and then we're going to loop this in like that like there we go like that so it should look like this so far the cat bands right here we have to bring the cat band to the bottom right here so we're gonna have to keep doing that so then it goes to the bottom twist it and you're gonna bring it in like that so you're gonna do that again loop it in. There we go. So it's at the bottom right here. So now we're going to do that again. So you're going to take the cat band and we're going to loop it at the top again. So you're going to push this. You're going to take this and loop it at the top. That, this part is a little hard because it'll keep slipping out of your hands. There we go. I got it at the top. It doesn't look like a pineapple yet, does it? <laughs> so, now you're going to take the next band. Well, basically the two shades. And you're going to twist it and bring it in again to your cap band and loop it like that. And then you're going to do the same thing. Again, like that. And loop through the four bands, the first four, like that. So it does not look like a pineapple because we're gonna have to add a lot more to it, to add a lot more to it. To add the leaves at the top and you have to finish this pineapple, which is almost done. There, looping this in, and there we go. If you guys can see closely, I'm pushing it in so then it doesn't snap. There we go. So this is our base of the pineapple. The cat bean came to the bottom. So now we're going to push this in, and we're going to start doing the leaves. So now what you're going to do first is you're going to take a dark green band and you're going to twist it on three times. 
and now we're going to take the next band, two bands, which is a light green and a dark green, and you're going to just take it like there, and then you're going to loop it like that. So the cap band should go inside them. So it should look like this. And then you're going to do the same thing three times. Loop it three times. And you're going to attach, not attach, but like put it in. It's a little hard to slip it on. It gets stuck sometimes. So you're going to have to slip that. There we go. That is perfect. So now we're going to do that one more time. And then we'll be doing something else to connect them. So here, put it in. And bring the loops inside. Yeah. There we go. It's a little weird, but it should get normal. So now what we're going to do is we're going to... Well, I'm going to show you how it looks like. This is how it should look like. And this is the bottom. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take one more band. Our last band. And then we're going to take this. So now what we're going to do is here. I'm going to put my finger right here. So it's like a, there like that. And then we're going to twist it to the bottom. And we're going to bring everything on this rubber band. You could do this step easily. Just slip it through all the bands. It's This part is also hard because it can get a little out of hand because then it'll, it'll get messy. I mean, it'll get stuck, not messy, but... Okay, so now your um, fruit, pineapple, I'm sorry, pineapple, it should look like this. This is totally not a pineapple yet because we have to do one more step. So we're going to make the slip knot. I'm going to just tug, make the slip knot with those two bands, tug it real well. And there. So now, there it is. It should look like this. It's a very nice pineapple. And now you guys are thinking what to do with this. The charm doesn't go like this. We and, and in fact, we're not we're not even doing the charm yet. Like doing the charm part. So we're going to loop it like that. So then it's so here. It's this. So now if you want a charm, I mean, you can leave it like this. If you want it to be a charm, you have to take one more band. And then you're going to take that band and... And what you're going to do is you're going to slip your hook through the cap band on the top. So the three loops, basically, like that. So you're going to have that, and then you're going to take your band, and you're going to loop it, and you're going to do this. So it should look like this. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take this, and we're going to just make our slip knot on the top. So now this is our pineapple. It's very pretty. So this is my pineapple. It's very cute.